What's up, everybody? Zavrin here, and today we're taking a look at Sledders. It's a sled game, as you can see here. We got single player, multiplayer. We can even host multiplayer games, change vehicles, outfits, all that stuff. You can see what we have available to us, what's locked, and uh, yeah, change your change our clothes. We even got default channel colors here. Not bad, but we're gonna go with gray. Um, it is developed by Hankai Games or Hanky Games. And published by Bonus Stage Publishing, and it's got a slated release date of December 5th of 2023 this year. So let's go ahead and jump in and see how it goes. All right. Oh, be careful. Okay. Well, how do we roll ourselves over here? We're just digging ourselves into the ground. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Uh, ski steers A and D, lean left, right, back and up is of oh, the arrows, arrow keys. Okay, so that's gonna be a pain in the ass. It's definitely gonna be a lot more um, slated for, say, a uh, uh, oh, did it again. Uh, controller stuff. Okay, let's start the whole world over again. Reset to snow. Let's go back to the garage here. Try it again. Single player. Start. We gotta figure out how we're gonna get out of the snow. Because this is very, very, very soft snow. We don't really skirt across the top of it. We more or less try not to flip over. Already. Already. All right, cool. No. Why are we rolling over, though? That doesn't make sense. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Just dig a big old hole, guys. We can't do anything. And then having... Having the uh, arrow keys as the lean buttons is silly. Um, uh, maybe using the mouse might be a little bit more reasonable. So we'll try this again. <laughs> it looks good. It does look good. But hopefully we can get something going. Why is it leaning backwards already? You can't do anything. You literally can't do anything. All right, let's go with the default. And then try that. Maybe there's a reason for it. Oh, it just lays sideways. It just lays sideways regardless. It just lays sideways. Let's go with the Pollux. We can't rock. It's not doing anything. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh. All right. Okay. Watch out for that tree. Oof. That was a gnarly crash there. All right. I, I just don't think uh, it, there's there's enough substance here. Um, <laughs> all we can do is just crash and roll over.
Let's go. Alright. There's not a lot we could do in this area anyways. Oops. There we went. Alright. Alright. Well, once you get comfortable with using both of your hands to steer, it's not too, too bad. It's definitely, I, I'd still say, more uh, controller friendly than um, mouse and keyboard friendly. Or just keyboard friendly, to be honest. There's no mouse involved in this at all. There's no reverse. There's no... Yeah, you can't reverse at all. Alright, so let's see. I don't know if there's a, a, um, an objective. There's like, doesn't seem to be any. But it looks good. It's You can tell it. They spend a lot of time though. Oops, there we went. Oops. Our bad. My bad. Um, They spend a lot of time on the models. Um, Unless it's just assets. I don't know. I can't. I don't surf through asset store, so I couldn't say whether or not it was they're just assets or whatnot, but it looks nice, is all I'm saying. It looks good. Um ouch. Okay. But it's a mat it's gonna be a matter of getting around. Trying to anyways. Get out of that tree. And then I guess are we are we trying to get down to the bottom of the hill? That's that's my Yes, right? Ouch. Can't do anything. All right, let's go again. Let's go again. If we're just trying to get down to the bottom of the hill, we could maybe get that done today. Maybe. I doubt it, but maybe. It looked pretty cool. Um, It made me... Well, now we're stuck, stuck. We can't really... Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we got a clearing. Um, it, I don't know. It, it, it looked like uh, something pretty neat. You know, there's a lot of dirt bike games, a lot of snowboarding games. There's a lot of car games in general. We're using our body to, as a fulcrum point to swing around <laughs> to swing to, to swing around the tree, which is always fantastic. Uh, I don't know where we're trying to get to though. There's a gold dot over there. But those are just, yeah, those are our primary uh, points on the compass. So. But we made it to a big flat spot here. I don't know where we're trying to get to. Yo, all right. But I'm assuming we'll be able to do like tricks and stuff like that once we get more into it. There's really a not a lot to it though, just to check it out though. Just a quick like uh, first look, I guess. It's it looks nice, like I said. It plays good. It plays really smooth. It's not I'm not getting a lot of like stutter, lag, anything like that. Uh it could be a heck of a lot worse, honestly. And then, like I said, you can still tell it's very, very, very early access, so. Um maybe some Audio would be all right. No. Oop. All right. It is fun, though. It is fun to mess around on. Um, I can see where this game could have poten a lot of potential, essentially. Um, we'll see where it goes from here. But yeah, this is just a nice quick first look. I think uh, as long as uh, as long as everything keeps going with it, where it's at now, I can see it having a lot, lot of uh, fun aspects added into it. It's already got multiplayer, so you could already be crashing in front of your friends and or within with people that you're playing with. So I don't know if multiplayer is actually implemented yet. It's just there. There's the ability of doing multiplayer. So we'll see uh, what happens there. Actually, you know what? Let's do that. Let's go back to the options. No. Uh, restore defaults. No. Back. Let's go to the garage. Let's go to browse multiplayer games. Okay, there is a couple. 24 of 32 people. Um, 
but I don't know what else would be going on there, right? Uh, Woodland, Max Player 4, that's fine. I want to see what happens. In multiplayer. Oh, it is. Cool. And that's fine. The biggest issue is not having anything to do. Right? That, that's my thing. You know, maybe a race game, obstacles would be kind of fun to see. Maybe missions, different the different little missions get from point A to point B or whatever, and maybe do like a rescue or something like that. Um, but yeah, it, it's pretty cool so far. So it's not a bad looking game at all by any means. So yeah, this is, but this is where we're going to go ahead and end this one. So thank you guys for stopping by. Thank you for liking and subscribing. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys think of this. And as always, you guys have yourselves a great day.